Hello everyone, I'm David Zarifpour and in this video I want to show you how we can assemble our parts faster than usual by mate reference. Here I have two parts that I want to assemble. One of the parts is like a bolt and second part has its place. If I want to assemble the parts, I have to add concentric and coincident mates for different faces which would be very time consuming if I wanted to do this for a large number of parts. I can do this automatically by using the mate reference command. For that, I open my first part, it's like a bolt. From features tab, from reference geometry, I select mate reference command. Here, for the reference name, I have to use the same name I use for second part. For example, I use mate1. Here, I have three faces I can select for mate. For the first one, I select this face and use the mate coincident. For the second part, second entities, second reference entities, I use this face and select concentric mate. And for the third part, third reference entities, I select this face and use coincident. Here, in mate reference, I use three faces and three mates and click OK. Here I have a folder for mate references. I can also use another mate references for different faces. I save this part and go to the second part. For this part, I use again mate reference, same as first part. I go to the mate reference. The name must be the same name as the first one, mate one. For the first primary reference entity, I select this face because I want to coincident the same faces. Again, I select coincident. For the secondary reference entities, I select this face and again select concentric, same as the first part. And for the third one, I select this face and select coincident as a mate. I click OK and save my part. Now I go to the assembly to assemble my parts. This is my first part and click insert component for import my second part, part four. As you can see, when I import my second part, it's automatically made by first component. And just I need to click for this one. That's all. And here, as you can see, three mates added to my components, coincident, the same faces I selected in the mate reference, concentric again, and coincident for these faces. By this method, we can automatically assemble our parts faster than usual. But don't forget, the mate reference name must be the same for each component we want to be assembled. I hope this video was useful for you. If you have any question about this video you can ask me in comments.